Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. My name's Renee, thank you so much for clicking on the video. Good morning and welcome to Beauty Ninja Mask Monday. Today we are going to do this P Pion Kang Yule Highly Moisturizing Essence Mask Pack. I'm not sure where I got this, I truly apologize. I was going through some of the masks I have in my fridge and I was like, I'll give this one a roll and see how it works. And then, we're gonna get into some empties. So if you wanna hang out, hang out with me for a little bit, stick around, I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, let me see if I can read what's on the back of this mask. See the instructiones. How to use, after cleansing, fix the skin texture with toner, which I did, lay the mask pack on your face, making sure to match up the eye, nose, and mouth holes. Keep the mask on for about 15 to 20 minutes, then remove and tap the remaining contents on the skin for absorption. Alrighty, so well, let's get into this. Yesterday, I went hiking with Tish. We went to Coal Creek. Was that it? I think it was Coal Creek. I was a little disappointed, guys, and you'll see why when the video goes up. I need a towel. I got laundry in right now. I got my towel on my lap. This is a shirt I got at the Mariner game. They were handing them out. We got up there pretty early and went to the lake, me and my son, because he wanted to go to a Mariner game. So he picked one and I got the tickets and we went up there and we went to the lake, um, the little shop there where they have all the Mariner gear and stuff. We went in there and I got him a jersey and then we went and stood in line because it was pretty close to the doors opening and we only had to stand there for, I don't know, a couple minutes before they opened the doors and let us in and they always have stuff that they give out to the first so many thousands of people that get there and that day it happened to be these shirts which is pretty cool. Sometimes they give out bobbleheads and stuff like that. <laughs> My son was like there there's nobody here I'm like because baseball isn't like football buddy it just doesn't sell out you know what I mean like except for opening day opening day is always super busy I actually with my ex and a friend of his we worked a stand I think it was two years in a row we we worked a stand at the game for opening night Whew, talk about getting your ass handed to you that was crazy crazy busy all right, let's get this mask on. All righty, guys, I got the mask on. It feels pretty nice. Man, putting these things in the fridge is amazing, especially in the summertime. It feels so good on your face. But the game was really good. Me and my son had a good time. We lost, which really sucks. Oh, and it was so close, too. Ninth inning. We had bases loaded, and we just couldn't make it happen. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and put this mask in the empties. I do have my timer set. All right, so let's get into the empties. First, we got this Nature Made Vitamin C 500 milligram antioxidant support, helps support the immune system. So I take vitamin C every day. I ended up, when I, got, when I was done with these, I ended up getting gummies because I really like the gummies, you guys. They taste so good, so good. And I also got D vitamins and B12 that I take every day. I have to take B12 for the rest of my life um, because of my thyroid issues, but yeah, vitamin C every day. We have Grace and Stella eye patches. I got these from Busy Beauty Customs. I'm actually all out of eye patches, you guys. I looked around and I used them all. I'm proud of myself for getting through all my eye patches. Next, we have this Tree Hut Strawberry Shea Sugar Scrub. I ended up getting through all of this. It took me a while. I got this from Busy Beauty Customs. This stuff is really great. Oh, and it smells so good. It smells so good. Oh, it's like a summertime picnic all over your body. All right, and then we've got this Face Dirty Everyday Pearl. I can't remember. Maybe this was a couple weeks ago, Mask Monday, that I used this. Busy Beauty Customs. These are all really good masks. I'll, I've said this before and I'll say it again. Every mask that I've ever done, I've never really had any issues. The only masks that have ever given me issues was a couple peel-off masks that I used. 
Hence why I don't really use peel off masks too often. I have a couple that I like that don't hurt and I will, you know, use those from time to time. But otherwise I stay away from, yeah, peel off and we don't mix. Next we have Wet n Wild Twinkle Star Setting Spray. I got this. Busy Beauty Custom sent me the whole like collection for PR. Uh, I think it was last year sometime and I finally got through this. I like it. It smells really good too. Yeah, it smells really good, but the whole set does. Like the um, little blush palettes, I think it was blush palettes, and they have like highlighter. They, they like smell really good, like crazy smell good. All right, and then we've got Pond's Cold Cream. This stuff works pretty good, although I have to say the Key Soul Care um, cleansing balm that I got in my Busy Beauty Customs, that stuff trumps everything that I've ever used. It's amazing when you're taking your makeup off. But this does work. I enjoyed it. I actually got this last year and just got it finished. I got it last year when I was over at my dad's on vacation visiting. Toothbrush. Got to change out the old and get a new one. Next we have the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. I'm pretty sure I got this in a Busy Beauty Customs. I'm not sure when. Um, but I finally got through that. It's a good setting spray. It really is. Makes your makeup last really long. All right, we got some more eye patches and face masks in here. So let's get through. Wow, we got a lot of them, you guys. I've been doing a lot, a lot of skincare, and I'm so proud of myself. So proud of myself. There is a lot in here, you guys, a lot. So we've got the Grace and Stella, A Dream Come Blue. We've got more of the gold ones. I got one, two... three and one just fell on the floor so one two three four of the little gold ones the two of the blue we've got the pink and I think that's all of them I dropped another mask oh my gosh my foot's cramping that's no boy now all right we got the zeal C green tea refreshing every pore is breathing face mask that I used we've got oats my bananas and that is facery we got Facery Glow Baby Glow, and I'm pretty sure I got all of these from Busy Beauty Customs. And then this one, Everyday Lemon. So, got through all of those. I do really, I love masking, you guys. I really do. Then I used this Makeup Removing Cleansing Wipes with Rose Water infused to help refresh and rejuvenate skin. There was 30 wipes in here. I got through this. It was a two-back two pack that I got from Busy Beauty Customs and I still have the other one in there but I got through this one so that's in the empties and then we've got this Revolution Pineapple Tonic uh, Brightening Tonic with Papaya Extract I finally got through this this stuff smells really good too and I got this Busy Beauty Customs it smells just like pineapple I love it if, if you don't like scent you probably wouldn't like it but I enjoyed it very much what is this? Vital 8-in-1 Multi-Benefit System deep, condition, deep Conditioning Mask for your hair. Love it. Love it. Love it. I can't remember where I got that. It might have been Busy Beauty Customs, but I'm not sure. Everything is Better in Pink. That was another eye patch that I used. I got through this R2M Ready to Make Up Silk Fiber Illicit Foam Cleanser from is that Kaylin this was pretty good not bad I'm really enjoying the one I'm using right now though and there's a couple other ones that I like I got through this hey honey open your eyes lifting eye serum this stuff's really good the only thing is the little thing like I don't know what happened but one day I was putting the lid on and it was like a little loose and then the next time I used it when I took the lid off and I went to squirt it out it was coming out the bottom and then the tip ended up falling out so I just kind of stored it like this and just tried to use it every morning and every night so that I could get through it. I, I really enjoyed it. I mean, I enjoy all the products I get. I don't usually have any issues with anything that I use. All right, the next thing we have is Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Pink Dream Body Cream. I just got through this a few days ago. I saw it sitting on my dresser in my room and I was like, Mm, I'm gonna use that it smells so good I had another one that I took with me to Vegas that I used when I went to Vegas super good super good deodorant you gotta smell good guys gotta control 
Gotta control the sweat. All right, we got another toothbrush. One was mine and one was my son's. So I replaced our toothbrushes, got rid of the old ones. Then what we have in here is I have all of these color switchers, which, um, yeah, they're all nasty. And I'm sure I could get like just new sponges and switch them out. But I have new color switchers that I got from Timu. So I'm just going to get rid of those ones and concentrate on the other ones that I have. Then we have e.l.f. Holy, Holy Hydration. This is Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. This stuff is pretty good too. I really, like, I can't stress enough how much I am loving the Key Soul Care one. It's amazing. But this stuff works really well too, especially like if you're on a budget. You know what I mean? Elf has really good products. And I think their whole holy hydration line is really good because I've used that um, as well as, you know, because I just kind of try things out. And I really love Elf. I've always loved Elf products. I will always love Elf products. All right, next, what do we have in here? I got through one of my scent box scents, and this is Bright Crystal. Let me see if I can read anything else on the bottom here. Just Bright Crystal. I'm not sure. I'm not sure who makes the Bright Crystal. Oh, my Lord. Oh, that smells good. Maybe I should keep this so I remember which ones I like. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. I got through this L'Oreal Paris Feria Power Shimmer Conditioner because like when I color my hair, I don't always use this whole thing. I mean, that's a lot of conditioner to put on your hair after you color it. So I use like a good portion of it, but then I keep the rest to use a few more times. So I finally got through that. And then this right here is what I have in my hair right now. It's the Truly Organic Star Fruit Hydrate and Shine Hair Mask. Buddha's Hand Chamomile Coconut Oil Boost. I've got this in my hair right now. I got this from Busy Beauty Customs and I really enjoy doing these hair masks. It's just that I'm not very consistent with it and I should do it, I should do it at least probably two or three times a week because of how dry my freaking hair is. And then I've also been going through my panty collection and um, I'll wear them for the day and at the end of the day, like I'm switching things out. Like most of the ones, I only have two pairs that I'm getting rid of right now because these are the only two so far that I've had issues with when I'm wearing them. Um, these ones right here, they're cute, but they like, they like really hurt in my crotch area. Not like hurt, hurt, but they're just, they're not very comfortable. So I'm gonna go ahead and toss those. And then these pink ones right here that I got from Splendies as well. These ones just, I don't know. I've worn them a couple times and I, I just don't like the way that they fit. Are they inside out? No, they're not inside out, but I just don't like the way that they fit. So I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of those. And that's it for the empties. I'm not sure the last time that I did my empties. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. Yeah, I'm definitely, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep the ones that I like and put them somewhere safe. And then the ones that are like, eh, okay, I'm going to just toss those ones. And that way I can remember which ones I like and which ones I don't for like if I want to go out and get like a larger size, which you, I, you can purchase from Scentbox, like the full size ones. And I think you get points maybe that you could use. I'm not sure. I've never tried that before, but I do believe that Scentbox has... Um, the full sizes maybe a little bit cheaper than you would get them like at the stores or at Sephora or Ulta. But anyways, those are my empties. I'm going to go ahead and get off of here and let this marinate a little bit more into my skin. And then I will be back and I will bid you guys adieu and let you know how my skin's feeling. So don't go anywhere. Alrighty guys, I'm back. The timer went off. I let it sit a little bit longer. It is starting to dry out a little bit, so we're gonna pat it on. There is a playlist linked down below with the other Beauty Ninjas. I hope that you will go down in my description box and click on the playlist and go check out the other ladies and see what they're up to this week. You can also follow the hashtag 
Mask Monday ladies or Mask Monday friends and find a lot of other channels and creators out there that have a wealth of stuff going on on Mask Mondays to share with you all. And I'm sure that you will find someone that you can connect with and join their family and show some love and support. I'm going to use my A New Ultimate Eye Cream to put underneath my eyes. Might as well finish my skincare with you guys, right? My skin feels very, I wouldn't say tacky, but very moisturized right now. I mean, that stuff. Woohoo! I think my face needed it after being out yesterday and hiking and everything, you know what I mean? Like being out in the elements. I do put a little bit of eye cream on my forehead and also my smile lines. I don't know if it helps, but you know, can't hurt, right? Can't hurt, right? So we'll give it a try. I'm not pulling on my under eyes. I'm just tapping, tapping the eye cream in. So, and then the next thing that I'm going to use is my Hey Honey Boosted Up Honey and Hyaluronic Acid Rich Moisturizer. I use this during the day and I use my Rock Night Cream at night. I got this Hey Honey in Busy Beauty Customs and I actually have another one as well. So, that's how much is used in here. So, when I get done with this one, I'll have another one that I can start getting into as well. I don't know what what day is today. today. Today, when this video goes up, it'll be Monday. Let me look at my calendar. Today is the sixteenth, so Monday will be the nineteenth. So today is the release of the Warriors Wear Pink palette with Gourmand Girls. If you haven't seen that video, I'll try to remember to link that down below. It's a beautiful palette. I've used it three different times. And yeah, it's just great. It's a great palette and it supports a great cause. They are going to donate 5%. Christina's going to donate 5% to Syria. I'm going to use this Rodial. This is Dragon's Blood Essence Mist. So after I do my skincare, I spray a little bit of this on my face. Just to kind of, you know, I don't know. I try to do whatever I can to try and keep my skin in a good condition. But anyways, Gourmand Girls, that palette went live today or is going live today because Mass Money goes up at 7 a.m. Uh, so in the next, it might already be up. It might already be live. So go check out Gourmand Girls. I have a code NANE10 so you can get 10% off your order and 5% goes to Syria to help her in her fight against breast cancer. I think Gourmand Girls is a really great brand. They have really great formula and uh, she's giving back. So that's amazing. And I'm actually going to purchase a palette myself. And uh, so stay tuned because there possibly might be a giveaway coming soon. So anyways, thanks for hanging out with me guys today. Uh, let me know, have any of you guys used the mask that I used today? Did you like it? I think it's amazing. My skin feels great right now. But um, yeah, <laughs> let me know what you thought of my empties as well. And uh, make sure you guys go check out Gourmand Girls. And if you haven't seen my Get Ready With Me With The Palette, I hope you'll go check it out because like, it really meant a lot to me that I was able to get that palette, use it, and film with it prior to it even getting released. So it meant a lot to me. So go check them out and Nene 10, like I said. If you're new to the channel, I hope that you will go down below, hit that subscribe button, join Nene's Glam Squad. We would love to have you here. Make sure you turn up the notification bell. That way you can get notified of any and all future uploads. Give this video a thumbs up. It would truly mean a lot to me. It really does help out my channel. And leave a comment, say hi, let me know that you stopped by. I love you all so very much. I hope you have an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening whatever time of day it is that you're watching this. Take care, stay safe, and I hope I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys!